Hi everybody, it's Paddyf21 here today, and today I will be showing you how to install Minecraft mods. So what you want to do is open up your internet browser out of Firefox. You want to go to Minecraft forums. I have mine bookmarked right there. If you don't have it, it's just simply www.minecraftforum.net. I'll have everything uh, put in the description, and you want to scroll down and find released mods under mapping and modding. Once you do that, from there you can pick your mods. So. That's what you're going to be looking for if you're following along. I will have this link in the description as well. So I'll show you how to install Mod Loader, which you need for all these mods. Mod Loader, you just download one of these. I click this one because it's straight up direct. If you want to be nice, you can click that one, and it helps the guy out and gives some money each download. So just save it. Then the mods I will be showing you how to download are Elemental Arrows. So you want to download that too. Save it. Also be downloading Spawner GUI Beta. And last but not least, Biosphere. And that's it for now. So you can go ahead and just downsize that or exit out. Now you want to go to Downloads. From there, you want to find your Minecraft mods. Just for now, create a simple folder on your desktop. Just drag and drop them in there. Right click and extract. Now what you want to do is go to the start menu and type in percent sign app data hit enter. Now you'll see dot minecraft go into bin you'll see minecraft dot jar and I also see minecraft dash one point five underscore zero one jar. You want to go to Minecraft jar. Hit open with WinRAR. You can also do this with WinZip, I believe it's called. 7-Zip, I'm not sure. But it'll open up this. Now, what you want to do is find something called Meta-INF. It'll be all in capitals. It'll just be one of the first here. But I already deleted it, so that's the one thing you want to make sure you delete. And then, once you do that, you just simply go into Mod Loader, copy all those out, just drag, drag them, just drop them in here. I've already done that. So I don't need to. Now for the arrows mod, you'll see all these classes and a separate folder. These separate folders are just simply, well this separate folder is just simply what the arrows look like. So you can even mess around with them if you want to redo the GUI. So you just want to drag all of that 
into there, it'll add the folder arrows. For Biosphere, all you do, same thing. And for Spawner GUI, you'll see Mod Spawner, GUI, GUI Mod Spawner, CV, CQ, and GUI. You just want to take the last four, drag them in there, and drop them. And what you'll also want to do is go into GUI take spawner out and put it in GUI because what that does is it adds the GUI in here for the mob spawner and I click there on one there it is I believe I'm not sure I can't remember what it what the file name is yep so it doesn't erase all of those other ones which are necessary for the game so like you're crafting then what you do is just simply exit exit out of everything and now we'll load up minecraft alright so now my minecraft loaded up correctly and if yours didn't then you'll see a black screen so, I will just simply create a world really quick just to show you that it works. And I will show you the mod, so I'll call my world Hi YouTube. So I'll just skip over the saving of it. And as it's generating the level, you know, skip over that. And there's your mods loaded in there. My Minecraft may seem a bit laggy because that's some stuff open. But that's pretty much it. See you next time.